Yeah, I think 2013 looks like a pretty good year in Texas for commercial real estate. Uh, I guess looking back on last year, we, we were fortunate to be in this sweet spot where you had sort of uncertainty due to the federal government holding back new construction in a way, but yet the Texas economy was doing, we're doing good here in Texas. And so you've had a good economy, which means increasing occupancy, increasing rental rates, and that new construction is being tempered really by uh, national issues more than local issues. And it looks like that's going to continue this year. Uh, I would say in the different markets, the major markets, for example, Houston has been driven by oil and gas, uh, you know, mainly, and that's doing well, but slowing down a bit, but uh, it should still do okay. And I think the Houston economy will, will do well this year. Then you've got San Antonio, which in the past really wasn't involved with oil and gas. And uh, now with the Eagleford Shale, it's getting the benefit from that. And it really got a boost from a lot of uh, military spending in the hospitals. And so you've got a lot of doctors and medical people that have come into San Antonio, and that's really helped their economy. And then you've got Austin, the tech sector, doing good. So Austin has no complaints. Uh, still really taking people from California uh, when they can to come out here. And then finally there's Dallas, who probably of the major metros is is performing the worst, but it's not bad by any means. It's just more tied to the national economy. So uh, it's just coming up a little bit slower than, uh, than the other markets. So I'd say, you know, finally going forward, probably depending on what side of the fence, if you're in the brokerage side, landlord, um, you know, there's going to be new construction, but it's still going to be tempered. So it uh, looks like rents and occupancy will continue to move up fairly steadily. But then if you're on the development side and you're trying to figure, you know, is this the year to pull the trigger or not? Uh, I, you know, I honestly don't know how those guys can make a decision in this environment we're in because uh, Supposedly there are three mini fiscal cliffs coming up in the next three months. And so you could build a project and, and really look like a champ if uh, everything goes well uh, with the economy. Or you could build something and the government do everything wrong and, and your timing might not be that well. But uh, you know, my gut feeling is that this year is, is going to be a very good year for commercial real estate.